Most people don't realize that every day in multiple places in the ocean around the world, from Brazil to Indonesia to the United Arab Emirates, large commercial ships in the ocean are getting away with dumping untreated oily bilge waste directly into the sea. But with the technology we have now, we're changing that. SkyTruth is a nonprofit conservation technology organization based in West Virginia. And we use satellite imagery to show people environmental problems and environmental concerns around the world. And we use that view to motivate people to take action to protect the environment. Project Cerulean is SkyTruth's answer to a global problem of intentional oil pollution from vessels traveling on the ocean. And the goal is to use machine learning as a tool that we can leverage against a otherwise insurmountable amount of data. Streaming down from satellites every day, we are able to use scaling EC2s on AWS to process hundreds, thousands of images and create insights and identify pollution events at a rate that uh, otherwise as an organization we'd never be able to match. We're using satellite images to detect these oily slicks in the ocean left by vessels, but we're using another type of satellite collected data called AIS, Automatic Identification System. And these are radio frequency broadcasts that many ships at sea send out very frequently to identify who they are and where they're going and how fast they're moving. By correlating those signals, that we collect from one set of satellites with the oil slicks that we see using another set of satellites, very often we can identify the vessel that is the polluter responsible for that oil slick. Our partnership with AWS makes it possible for us to do projects at a scale that we really couldn't do before. Using satellite imagery that's flowing into the S3 buckets and using fast AI and PyTorch to train machine learning models within the AWS cloud infrastructure is turbocharging SkyTruth's ability not only to detect oil pollution everywhere in the ocean, but ultimately to monitor human activity everywhere on land and the impact that activity can have on the environment. What's most exciting about this technology is that now the, we have the ability to bring many more people into the work that we do and invite the public to become sky truthers, to look at satellite imagery, to do some simple analysis of their own, and then to tell us what they're seeing, what they think is important happening in the environment around them. And for our team at SkyTruth, this is a thrilling time to be doing the work that we do.